Hi everybody, it's Pamela Ferguson. Today I'm going to talk to you about working for someone else. Who feels that they are paid what they're worth? Anyone? Anyone? Bueller? Bueller? Anyone feel that they are paid what they're worth? And who feels completely secure in their job? Anyone? Now these are both things that unless you're self-employed, you're probably like, well, no, no full job security and no, I definitely am the best worker there and I'm not paid what I'm worth. And I wanted to do this video today because so I heard some statistics uh, this week and they were very interesting to me. So let me read them to you so you can be as shocked as I was. Okay. Um, as you know, we have right now a high rate of unemployment. Uh, among the country and 30% of US workers have saved less than a thousand dollars for when they retire less than a thousand dollars that's horrible that's really bad 75% of retirees report not saving enough money well that's not surprising it's not surprising four to five adults in the US struggle with near poverty now, I don't have the actual statistics on what is that considered, but still, the, the stat itself was um, very surprising. The thing that I wanted to do a video about is that, do you are you making the same de decisions day in and day out and expecting a different result? Are you going to that W-2 job nine to five and thinking, you know, one day I'm gonna get out of this? Uh, are you complaining about your job? Are you complaining about your boss and you're not appreciated and you know all the I had to work overtime and you didn't get paid for it and all these things. Is that you? Because if it is, I mean, how long are you just going to stay where you are without doing something about it? Are you willing to participate in your own rescue? Everyone has a decision for their own life that you're just complaining but not willing to do anything about it. When is that going to change? A lot of companies may not be perfect and the venue I want to talk about is direct sales. It's not perfect. It's just better. It's just better than the traditional job because the opportunities are endless. The financial opportunities, the flexibility of the schedules, the, the perks, the bonuses, the camaraderie within the teams, these are amazing opportunities, and do you have those things in your company? Now, if you do, you're very lucky. But I would say, having been in the workforce myself and having many jobs over the years, there were many jobs that I just couldn't stand. I did it because I needed to work, because I needed the money. I had a car payment, I had a, an apartment or a house payment or whatever it is, but I didn't really adore the job. So when are you going to say, you know what, I can't do this? But you may say, well, yeah, I want to do that, but I just can't quit my job. I need the insurance. I need all these things. How about if there was another option? Have you ever thought of maybe a plan B or trying to start up something on the side? Continue with your regular job. Try to build a business on the side. I have many people on my team who have full-time jobs and they are building this business on the side. Over time, some of them have been able to replace their income at their, you know, their original job and be able to quit, or maybe they've cut to part-time hours or whatever it may be. And that may be an option for you. And even if it's not an option for you, it could really help take off some of the financial stress. Maybe it helps you put away money for retirement. A thousand dollars? That's awful. Don't let that be you. Take today, do something different with your life. Life is 10% what happens to you, 90% how you react. How are you going to react when you're in the same situation over and over? I've spoken to people, they're like, oh, I need a job, I need this, and they're, when I come to them about direct sales, they're like, oh, well, you know, I can't do direct sales. When are you going to take the reins of your own life? Why can't you do direct sales? Because of what it's perceived? This could completely change your life. Could completely change your life. You have to take chances when you're sitting in a position of detesting where you are. 
continuing to do the same. Do you think if you're struggling to pay your bills and just continuing to do what you're doing is going to change that? Of course not. What they say, the definition of, of insanity is continuing to do the same thing over and over again and expecting a different result. This is where you need to stop. Stop the insanity. Check into other options. Check into direct sales. It's been amazing for my family. It has completely changed our lives. It's allowed us to be able to give back to charities and put away money for retirement and college that we were never able to do before. Please do it for yourself. Have a great day.